Welcome back to my channel. Today we're diving into how a CNG engine works and how it's similar to a traditional gasoline engine. CNG or compressed natural gas is gaining popularity as a cleaner fuel alternative. Understanding its operation can help us appreciate its benefits. Let's start with the basics. Both CNG and gasoline engines operate on a four stroke cycle. This includes intake, compression, power and exhaust. Let's break it down. At intake stroke, the intake valve opens and a mixture of air and fuel enters the combustion chamber. Second is compression stroke. In this stroke, the piston moves up, compressing that air fuel mixture, increasing its temperature and pressure. Next is power stroke. At the top, the spark plug ignites the mixture, causing an explosion that pushes the piston down. Next exhaust stroke. Finally, the exhaust valve opens and the piston pushes out the spent gases. Now let's talk about the fuel system. CNG is stored in high pressure tanks on the vehicle, usually around 3000 to 3600 psi. CNG has a higher octane rating, allowing for more efficient combustion and reducing knocking. The explosion from the ignition drives the piston down, turning the crankshaft just like in gasoline engines. Engine management systems are often tuned to optimize performance with CNG. One of the significant benefits of CNG is its cleaner air is its cleaner emissions. CNG produces fewer pollutants like carbon monoxide and hydrocarbons compared to gasoline. Using CNG can help reduce greenhouse gas emissions, making it a more environmentally friendly option. In summary, CNG engines operate similarly to gasoline engines with some adjustments for fuel type and combustion properties. If you found this video helpful, please like, share and subscribe for more content on engines and alternative fuels. Let me know in the comments if you have any questions or topics you'd like to see next.